guys welcome to my channel if you are a fashionista if you like to be in the latest trends please pay attention to the fabrics that you're buying this Zara haul is essentially about pieces that keep on getting restocked so what I'm gonna walk you through and what I'll be doing on my channel is basically as usual to continue educating you about what to buy what to look for if you want some good quality items and yes there are some items that I may haul that are not good quality items but as I said I'll be educating you so that you avoid these items no matter how pretty they are guys remember all that glitters is not gold so of course I've, I've gone back to my friend <laughs> and by my friend I mean linen oh guys I know uh, I I've wanted this piece for quite some time now it's it was one of Zara's best sellers about two years ago but as you may have noticed from Zara, they restock their best sellers. And I love that because if I miss a particular piece, uh, yeah, I definitely look forward to when Zara restocks. And they did not disappoint with this one. I love this. This is such a great piece. It's a wrap dress. It's 100% linen. And it's, it's just gorgeous. It's, it's a little too big for me but what I did it's on sale so I know that I can adjust it myself so it's not gonna cost me to adjust it so that's what I did I adjusted the buttons they were right here so I switched them to here and now it's able to fit me as a medium so I really, really love this piece. So this is definitely a great buy. If you see it being restocked, definitely grab it. a buy because it's linen environmentally friendly great piece great style something that you can have in your wardrobe for years to come and I'm so happy I got it I paid I think I paid less than $29.99 but the sale price is this now on to some of my favorite favorite things guys Sorry to interrupt guys, but just a quick note. Just in case you like me and want to stay apprised of all of my videos, do click the red subscribe button and click the notification bell and you'll be notified when I upload a video. So here they are guys. If you click on these buttons, you'll be part of my channel and you'll be notified when I post new videos. I have been uploading Saturdays. Sometimes if I'm too tired, I upload on a Sunday. But if you love me, come on back and subscribe. I'll definitely love to have you. Now, let's get back to the video. As you know, plaid is in. It's everywhere. I, I do love plaid. I actually love plaid more than gingham. <laughs> Surprisingly, I do love plaid has a bunch of them in my wardrobe and i'm just adding this to the collection and again this is a piece of course it's from zara so it's a zara haul it's a gorgeous piece <laughs>
white leg, gray, nude, and blue. I love this color combo. It's absolutely gorgeous. <laughs> This piece is 89% polyester and 11% viscose. If that adds up to 100, yes, that's what it is. <laughs> yes, that's what it is. It's not the greatest environmentally friendly piece, but I can live with it because one, it has viscose in it, which is biodegradable and it's environmentally friendly. So I don't mind this at all. I feel no guilt buying this because I know that I would be wearing it for, for quite some time and I, feel, I, I do get some comfort from knowing that it's not 100% polyester. So for me personally, I've been wearing this like crazy. It's, I, I just love the colors of the check marks on it. Check marks. It's not a check mark. <laughs> but I just love the color scheme on this check piece. So it's really great for work and I, I love it. Fits beautifully as you would see from the cutout. next season yeah I would say I would give it a tentative buy not a hundred percent buy but fifty percent buy mainly because it contains 89 percent polyester but love the fit love the style and who says I need another of this style of pants apparently I do so I bought this I, as you guys know, I have the black, two pairs of the black in this. I have the red. I have, I have the orangey rust color and I have another white. And I, it's such a great fit pants, but I don't think it's environmentally friendly despite the fact that I love it. Yes, I love it. I love the fit of it. I love the style. I love the way it's made. suspicion it was going to be polyester it's a hundred percent polyester ah oh, I'm so disappointed I have so many of these I am not guys I must admit that I have not been paying attention I have been focused on fit and style okay which means going forward, I would not be buying any more of these. I would continue to wear these ones that I have, but I am 
going to definitely try to avoid buying this type of material no matter how beautiful it is no matter how gorgeous it fits I'm gonna try to avoid this because it's a hundred percent polyester and as I've said from the very beginning this is a piece that keeps on being restocked Dara has the colored style as well as the long floor length trouser style like this one here and it's it's a bestseller it keeps on restocking but it's polyester I can understand why people buy it because it's absolutely gorgeous as I said it's a great fit but going forward I am just letting you know that if you want to contribute a little bit to the environment let's force Zara to make these gorgeous pants in cotton or linen they would look so gorgeous because these are now $79.99 for polyester that should not be the case so Zara if you're listening we need cotton a hundred percent cotton or even viscose I don't mind or linen because these are gorgeous pants I love them to pieces that's why I have so many but we need more environmentally friendly fabrics and materials to wear if we are going to be paying so much money give us the materials that we can feel better going to bed at night knowing that we have contributed a little to the environment with these styles oh i'm so heartbroken because i love i love all of these pants i love them and it it breaks my heart to to not buy them anymore but that's what i'm going to do so i got this and guys when i first saw this i was definitely not attracted to it you know sometimes you have to give people a second chance it's the same as some clothing items you definitely have to give them a second chance when i saw it i'm like ah oh, i'm tired of this pajama thread i'm so over it now oh my god i tried it on and this woman went completely nuts she's like you have to you have to have it you look gorgeous you look like a model and I'm like okay all right I'll get it <laughs> so she started laughing and so she said let me try it if you don't want it let me try it so I gave it to her to try it but it was a little bit too snug for her so she she had to get a bigger size and she said you have to get it I'm like okay I will get it it does look really really nice it's jumpsuit it looks really much better on than off but geez does it warrant her exclamation I mean guys you should have been there to hear this woman <laughs> I mean yes it really looks great on and it's it's gorgeous I like it surprisingly so if you see it in the store you just pass it by because it looks like pajamas but yes it, it it does it does warrant a second look and yeah it's 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 pretty 
it's actually prettier than I thought but you would have thought that she was a Zara salesperson and she's not she was just a client just like me but it's very nice of her to to compliment me that way I like that I, I love women who do that and I have always been the one to tell you yeah that looks great on you you should get it <laughs> but it's always nice when it's flipped on you so you feel you feel you feel good about yourself so here it is <laughs> it's a really great piece that you can wear for dinner out with the girls and you can even just just wear it wherever you want to wear it and if you're like me this is a piece that you can wear anywhere anywhere guys i do not want to sit here and tell people where to wear this stuff because I wear my stuff wherever and whenever and this is a habit from long ago. I am a poor woman. I grew up poor so I had to strategize and I had to be creative with my clothing items. So because of that, I buy pieces that are versatile and my definition of versatility comes in many forms. One, I can wear it to dinner, I can wear it to work, I can wear it on a date, I can wear it anywhere, I can wear it to church, and that's me, that's how I love my clothing items. They are not to be confined to a special occasion. So many people used to look at me funny for that when I was growing up and look at me as if, wow, you're wearing that to church, to work? And then you're wearing it out yeah it's mine <laughs> and I don't care even if I can do better now I still like my pieces to be versatile I still love to get bang for my money I still love to get wear out of my items I'm gonna wear them wherever until I cannot wear them anymore okay <laughs> Okay, let me stop being, let me stop being me for a little bit. No, I could never stop being me. Let's see the fabrication. And my last piece is a jeans where you guys saw my last jeans fail so i was eyeing this at zara for quite some time it was priced at 79.99 <laughs> But when I saw it, I couldn't justify it at all. Yes, it's a real jeans material. It doesn't have a lot of stretch. It's 100% cotton. It's the real thing. But at the same time, I couldn't justify it because I have two similar pairs of jeans in my closet just like this but because I love them and they are very old they are over probably 25 years old but it's the style that I love so I've had them forever in fact it was one of my girlfriends um, Karen Karen if you're watching thank you I love you to pieces Thank you for giving me those two pants. Love them. So, yes, I bought this because I wanted to wear this one to work. I really love this look on a casual Friday. It really, really works beautifully for me. And when paired with a fitted jacket like this piece, oh my God, I get so many compliments on this pairing.
I think it's the wash of these pants as well as the fit. I love the wide legs. You guys know me. That's my signature look. So it fits perfectly with my wardrobe. Are more, they are, they are old enough that I don't feel I should wear them to work. So hence my reason for investing in this. But it was in the sale and it wasn't exactly a bestseller because there were many items left during the sale but for some reason when the sale was on they went like crazy which means that had it been priced at a lower price yeah had it been priced at a lower price people would have made it a bestseller early on so it's a great piece love it and if you see it buy it I got it for $29.99 and I think it was even further reduced but they didn't want to give me the price when I tried to return it and I think my 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 size was gone as well so I couldn't get it exchanged but yes guys and of course in the sale there were a couple shoes and boots that I didn't initially bought but had my eyes on them don't even bother telling me yes I know I have enough boots to last me a lifetime but this was $35 initially priced almost I think almost two hundred dollars I think but yeah what was the initial price oh the initial price is I got it for $35 I mean it's a hundred percent suede leather why should I give it up? It's a beau it's a beautiful piece, beautifully made, and the suede is it's really thick and 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 really sturdy. It H&M that I had to return so love it really great price point and this is something this style is still on Zara and it's being restocked so look out for it if you see it you 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 don't necessarily have to buy it now you can do like me and wait until the sale so really great buy love it this guys you would not believe how much I paid for this and it's gorgeous this was initially priced okay I took the tag off but it was it was right up there because it's also leather and I paid nine dollars and 99 cents for this it was a bestseller it's it also sold out pretty quickly but this is not my real size and for some reason it fits when it comes to slip-ons you can size up or down depending on the style I find that when it's very open like this one strap you can get away with sizing down and that's what I did I sized down to well the only sizes left were six six and seven and a half and i wear eight so i took a gamble that the seven and a half would work for me and it paid off love this piece it looks so expensive well 
it is expensive initially I just happened to get it at a bargain price if you see it buy it it's leather it's environmentally friendly and it's not going anywhere you're gonna have this in your wardrobe for years to come yes love this so yes guys those are the pieces that you can look out for they are often being restocked and take your time if you're thinking of buying anything you have this video as a reference guide look at the fabrication of all the beautiful pieces I just showed you and make your decision don't just go on prettiness think about the environment and at the same time let us send a message to the companies that we want environmentally friendly fabrics as well as we want great fabrics on our bodies because our bodies are fabulous right <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching and don't forget to subscribe and i'll see you in the next one take care bye bye guys love you love you thank you for your support thank you so much and i'll see you soon bye